Republicans are spending big to try to knock off powerful Hudson Valley Congressman Sean Patrick Maloney. Maloney chairs the Democratic Congressional Campaign Committee and may now be in danger of losing a race. CBS 2's Tony Ayello spoke with him and GOP challenger Mike Lawler. All signs point to a competitive race between Mike Lawler and Sean Patrick Maloney, now rated by most pundits as a toss-up. I have a 10-year record of results. Democrat Maloney is facing a wave of negative ads from conservative political action committees. Sean Patrick Maloney voted for all the taxing and spending that tanked our economy. Ten million bucks will make a race pretty close, but, you know, we've got good people and a grassroots army, and we're going to win. Outside money is flowing in large part because Maloney appears vulnerable. Redistricting has him running in a newly drawn north suburban district with many residents he's never represented. People are laser focused on the issue of inflation, and the cost of living, and crime. Republican Mike Lawler has hammered Maloney on the economy. Well, listen, under Joe Biden, they've increased spending by over $4 trillion. You cannot spend that amount of money and print that amount of new money and not have record inflation. Uh, they also limited domestic production of energy. And when you do that, it drives up the cost of everything. I'm not perfect. Democrats aren't perfect. But uh, to all those fair-minded Republicans and independents out there, uh, we've got a plan to give you cheaper gas and groceries, health care, housing, give you safer streets, support good policing. Democrats are attacking Lawler for his anti-abortion position and tying him to former President Trump. Mega Mike Lawler, way too extreme for the Hudson Valley. I've ignored it and focused on, on the challenge ahead because that's where voters are. It's the final stretch of a spirited campaign. Tony Aiello, CBS 2 News.